teams will be contained in separate cages with one member of each team starting the match. At regular intervals, alternating members from each team will be released to enter the match. The team with the advantage will be the first to have a member released into the match. Once all competitors have entered, War Games officially begins. The match can only be won by pinfall. Exiting the cage will result in a forfeit. Now, let the War Games begin! One of those damn Dudleys is at it again. Who knows what we'll see tonight? Introducing first, representing the Dudley Boys from Dudleyville, weighing in at 269 pounds, Devon Dudley! There is perhaps no greater challenge than the one this man is about to face. War Games, one of the most brutal contests a superstar could find themselves in. And he has plenty of cause for concern because shortly after that bell rings, he'll find himself outnumbered. He has to be prepared for an onslaught like no other. Does he stand his ground and try to fight it? Or give his opponents the runaround until help arrives? Well, he's got two rings worth of room to work with. But in war games, there are no easy answers or surefire solutions. All right! I love this guy! From Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds, the Superstar! Being the one to kick off a War Games match is not easy. There's tons of pressure resting on you to get your team off to a good start. Well, lucky for him, he won't have to wait too long until the Calvary arrives. That's right, this team will have the numbers advantage here, but it's not so easy to capitalize on that advantage. Well, it's only a matter of moments now until we find out if he's up to the challenge that is War Games. He says it's all about dominance tonight and plans on showing why everyone backstage should be scared. The War Games match, definitely not for the squeamish. Two teams of superstars with license to truly do whatever they want to each other. As a fairly squeamish guy myself, this match always makes me uncomfortable, but it's a huge opportunity to make a moment or cement yourself as a star to watch. I hope someone here does that, and I hope nobody gets too hurt. Boot to the stomach gives them separation. And Devon escapes danger. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Stunning this play of power. Well, they say everyone has a plan until they get punched in the mouth. Well, someone just threw their plan out the window. He tosses him over and into the other ring. Bring in the arm. Ooh, what? Wasn't expecting that. Short clothesline hits its mark. Shoulder tackle. Flapjack. The countdown hurtling towards a shift to the status quo. Elbow throw saying not today. Holding cages open, and away they go, ready to get into the action. <laughs> Denied with an elbow. Numbers advantage or not, he's leaving nothing to chance as he searches under the apron. 
down on the neck with reckless abandon. Arm control applied and a kick right to the midsection. He's able to sidestep there. Come on now. Is it not enough that they're already coming in with an advantage here? Is this really necessary? Nice Japanese on drag. What a shot! Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. And walking through the structure door, this is where nightmares become reality. And as things begin to devolve even further, Corey, every competitor's head is on a swivel. Is there even room to strategize in such treacherous terrain? I'm not sure what the game plan was for either of these teams coming into this one, but I have to imagine things are already starting to reach a point where all that planning has officially gone out the window. And here we go. They're on a mission to save the day and won't be stopped. Looking for something under the apron before entering. He's not interested in just evening the odds. He wants the advantage, and that weapon gives it to him. Crashing down like that, having the wind knocked out of you, never a good time for that to happen. And repeated impacts like that will weaken you mentally as much as it does physically. That powerbomb was absolutely worthy of both halves of its name. Going right after the neck. Neckbreaker. That's a bad landing. Devon creates an opening. Devon now has his opponent set up. The saving grace. Can Devon end this? The crowd is counting it down. Next entry will tip the scales in their team's favor. Oh, man. Inverted backbreaker. Ow. Gentlemen, the advantage has officially shifted. Getting carried. Unsure what they're thinking. Oh, oh man. Taking it to the trachea. Ooh, merciless looking blow. And entering into an absolute war zone, giving the troops the boost they need. Crafty way to get out of hold there. Hard drag. Very nice. Trapped in the corner. Just non-stop blows. He's reached the top, but he's risking losing the whole match if he falls to the outside. Oh, no! Holy hell! That's it! That's it! Taking it to the top of the cage and defying all of gravity on the way down. Could be the biggest tide turner of this whole match. Boom! Sandman turns that away. Tossed clear across that gap and crashing down into the opposite ring. And seconds left before the odds are even here. Oh my goodness, next to him. Got to minimize the damage now. Go help your teammates immediately. And that was an effective attack, guys. Punch. Bubba Ray executing the play. Bubba could take this one. Ooh, that hurt right to the kidney. Come on, Lee. Oh, good night. Sure. Ooh, back drop. Super on a high angle right across the shoulders. Hold on a second. He might be finding a submission hold here. Climbing up the wall now, and he's got some crazy idea in my Lift off! And full control here! A base full of turnbuckle. Here we go! Ooh and Devon is up really. There's 
some real danger staring Devon in the face here. Sandman has set his target. And Devon being hammered again. I don't know how much more Devon can stand. Look out! in the strategy now. Sandman has him hooked. Pile driver. Is it enough? Is it enough for the Sandman? Guys, I can't think of a worse place for him to be right now. Devon setting his opponent up. Able to give him the slip. Into the cage now, and the numbers advantage is locked in. And the damage is just going to keep on coming if you can't find the defense for this. Dodges the attack. Just a smidge quicker. Beautiful arm ringer applied. Bang! So accurate. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Piercing shot with the blast off. Diving low drop from the top rope. Is this what he needs for the win? Oh, tracked across the skull with that barbed wire back. Not a single perk. Another big move. Ooh. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. Well, that was in big, big trouble. Hooked up. Mere seconds away from evening the odds in war games. It's always disorienting taking those hits above the shoulders. Suplex. Out of the cage and rushing into a... Devon. Or to the point of the from down with saving grace. Devon could have this one. The teams are squared up, but he doesn't think that's enough, apparently. Any more hits in that area could leave him dizzy. And they're not going to go into this one without a little back up in their corner. The point is slammed down. are contained inside the cage. The door is shut, and we're on the brink of absolute chaos. War Games can now officially pass. Sandman is in a very vulnerable position here. Side headlock applied. Is that time? Crucial moment for the Sandman. To the sky. Oh, no, this is a good idea. This is going to take more strength. He wants it one more time. For what it's all about. Escapes and a chop block takes him down. And Bars counter. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Oh, sweet. All right. Will it be? I think so. What a battle, what a war. Strong showing from both these teams tonight, but congratulations are in order here. Got to give this team credit. Few matches put you to the test like War Games does. So to win this really speaks to their abilities. Absolutely. They can hold their heads high.